Hi, I'm Betsy Wilson Mahoney and welcome to the studio. My name is Leslie Alexander and I am a painter. My name is Shelley Marshall Schmidt and I'm a photographer, graphic designer. Hi, I'm Frank Lustig. I've been in Aiken since 1977. I started off after I retired dabbling in watercolors for about a year, year and a half. I spend most of my time working on raku pieces and I've always loved gardening, plants, working with the soil and uh, I just love the feel of clay and I, I realized that by hand building it gave me a lot more opportunities to see uh, results of my work. I wanted to come back to my hometown Aiken and make a career as an artist. My favorite painting about Aiken is always the one I'm working on. The right place was to be right down here on the street because I'm a chatty artist. It's just neat. It's the whole thing of coming back home to be an artist in your hometown. I just, I can never remember wanting to do anything else. I'm an abstract painter. Um, I have a strong spiritual base to my paintings. Not always been a painter. And I have not always painted in the way that I paint now. My art is inspired by a reality, but not necessarily the, the physical reality that we all look at. I try to use color and texture. I'm just a kid at heart, really. I've been here, I think, 11 years now, so I'm doing some, a little bit, something a little different all the time. I do love to photograph polo. I love photographing horses in general. The first major project I had in the Aiken area was horseplay. That was a project that really was a thrill to be involved in. Aiken is a mecca for artists for several reasons. It's the type of town that um, lends itself to a slower lifestyle. They are so supportive, this town in general, of all facets of art. It's such a beautiful town with flowers and buildings. I'm inspired by the, the natural, physical surroundings. Hitchcock Woods inspires a lot of people. Inspires me. We've got this beautiful Center for the Arts. Our Aiken Art Guild is uh, really uh, active. It goes beyond the camaraderie here in the studio. About four years ago, a man, his name is Patrick Brooks, had taken this building, he just had this vision of turning it into an art community. He would take an upstairs loft area, not fix it up for living, but fix it up just enough so that maybe artists could come and be here. It's, it's just a perfect environment to be working in. It's been a very, very great partnership for me. We can critique each other, inspire each other. I'm here with good friends, most of us even spend time together walking in the morning. This is a fabulous place upstairs. We have all different kinds of artists up there. Painters, photographers. Realistic artists, abstract artists, a writer. Even though it's totally different from what I am doing, it's uh, still of great interest to me. We just got a lot of very talented people here. 